Hey guys, welcome back. Today I have a video for you. <laughs> Clearly. Oh my gosh. Uh, today I have the Painted Phalanges The Wizard Collection to show you. Now this has a lot of situations happening. So I have four polishes to show you. There are also two um, core polishes and then some toppers. This is called a Builder Collection. So things will be added to this. Let me read you some information. If you are going to the Portland Indie Shop, I'm not sure when that is. That probably already happened. Uh, it, you can purchase it early there, but otherwise this is going to be available August 14th on PaintedFlanges.com. The Wizard Basics are going to be sold separately for $8 each as a pair for $15, or you can purchase the entire set of polishes, which is eight polishes. It looks like for $70. There are two basics, a white and a black cream. I'm not going to go over those too much because I don't have those to show you. So there's a, a white and a black cream. The white cream is called Albus. The black cream is called Sirius. The wizard toppers are Enchantment and My Niffler. And then I have four colors. They're going to be $11 each or the four piece set for $40 or the full set for $70. These colors were inspired by swears from the wizarding world. The first polish is called Merlin's Beard. This is an intense bright red with a golden shimmer. This one covers in three coats. It's super close in two, but I could still see just a little bit of nail line on the second coat, so I added the third for full opacity. <laughs> you can hear a dog sighing. There's a dog in here just moping his life away. This one covers in three coats. It does dry a little bit dull, so you will want a top coat to really bring out those shimmers, like it's shiny and glassy and glossy and beautiful. But that is three coats of Merlin's beard. The next polish is called Dung Brains. This <laughs> Uh, this is a neon leaning orange red with some blue shimmer, blue green purple shifting multi-chrome flakies, and shifting iridescent micro flakies. This one covers in three coats. Because it has that neon pigment in it, it does dry a little bit dull, so you'll want a shiny top coat to bring out all the flakies and shimmer and make it shiny. But otherwise it has a good formula, um, and it's a really fun, I mean, who doesn't love a neon? If you don't love neon. I don't even know what's wrong with you. Just kidding. Next <laughs> stop dog is just staring at me. It's my mom's dog. It's not just a random dog. How great would that be if just a random dog showed up in my house? It would be amazing. The next file is called Galloping Gorgons. Gorgons? This is a bright Olympic blue full of fun matte green hex glitter and green gold shifting shimmer. This one is two to three coats. I had, I always say this if you don't know, I have one, sometimes two nails that almost always need an extra coat. So if something is close on two, they for sure need the third. So it's two to three coats depending on you know the condition of your nails, but I did two coats on two nails and three coats on two nails. Two to three coats depending on your nail length and you know how thick you apply polish and those types of variables that no one can take into account except for you. We'll want a top coat for sure with this because there are glitters in here. The base is gonna dry down around those a little bit. I used the smooth phalanges and then a top coat just to make everything look really smooth. The last polish is called Sizzling Dragon Bogies. This is a bright green crelly. It's sort of a limey, chartreuse -y crelly. There's shifting micro flakies, iridescent micro flakies, and pink, blue, and purple glitter. The blue and the um, purple glitter really stand out. The pink glitter is very, very small and very, very pale, so it almost looks like a silver glitter. Um, 
I would probably put this one upside down a little bit before you apply it just to get just to get as much glitter as possible to the neck of the bottle um, but this one covers in three coats and the same thing you're going to want probably a smoothing layer or a nice thick top coat to really smooth everything out. So the Wizards collection will be available August 14th on PaintedFlanges.com. All of this information is listed in the description box. If you want just these four polishes, it is $40 for the set or $11 a piece. And then if you want the entire Wizards collection with the basics and toppers, that is available also for $70. If you guys enjoyed this video, thank you so much for watching. Let me know which polish is your favorite. Did you go to the Portland Indie Shop? I would love to go to Portland. I've never been to Oregon. I've been to like a lot of the west side of the country actually. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll talk to you in my next video.